really, but... <laughs> I have terrible like expectations. Like that's literally all I want, but it's impossible. Mm. I don't know. I think if you try hard enough, I have a feeling. I just I don't know. I have a feeling. I need like a billionaire that's a dumbass that like <laughs> okay, like for example like crypto people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like crypto people that hire people. Okay, there. Are, okay, <laughs> one one of the reasons I quit a job. There was this girl. Her job also her she was making six figures mm. to sit in a she was a community person. Right. She sat in Slack and just talked to fucking random people. And just that's it. All, all you gotta do is fucking <laughs> sit on Slack. Yeah. Like just tweet or something. Mm. Which is the same kind of shit I'm doing, but she had no following. Yeah. And uh I figure, hey, if I have a fucking social media following, I should I don't know, I was upset that that person made a lot of money yeah with that there's shit. so many people like that though it's 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 insane it's just it's the market's so saturated in terms of social media influencers yeah i mean this person wasn't an influencer though there's or, people that yeah. have no following yeah and they and just get pay, mm-hmm. community people and they just get six figures yeah because they're literally like, just fucking send messages. Yeah, in they're, the, they're the quote unquote legitimate viewer. They're the yeah, they're the legitimate viewers for people's channels when they when they can't get bots or don't want to bot. They just yeah, they pay these groups of yeah. There's whole like firms and like <laughs> yeah, you just get hired by these weird online companies, and they yeah, yeah they pay you to post on social media. Yeah, I just don't know, man. I can't. I'm just at my parents' house because. I just want to fucking have a million dollars, and I don't see how living in an apartment will get me there at any oh, point. Oh, man, no. Yeah, no. Rent is just you're pissing money away. It doesn't make, it make zero do sense. Do you pay rent? Fuck no. <laughs> I just can't do it. Like, I, I want to, but, okay, like, two years ago, I could go get an Airbnb for $1,000, even just last year, probably like a thousand bucks to fi- 1500 max yeah, would get me a nice apartment. Hmm. And now I cannot move anywhere good for less. Th- like every apartment is shit unless you're paying 2500 yep. plus yep. at least. Yep. Yeah, so at this point, I'm just fucked. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, yeah. It's, so it's, I, I'm going to spend seven grand. I, I mean, dude, apartment is my the least of my concerns. Unless you Even- want a fucking roommate. Then you're yeah, and still it still it doesn't make sense. Yeah. Oh, I do. I can't. I mean, I can't find a roommate for the life of me. It's fucking impossible. Mm-hmm. Like I'm not gonna go to roommate.com or it's got to be yeah, someone yeah. I know. And everyone, I'm like to the point where people have girlfriends and are old and shit. So, yeah. Ilya Tom, you can be my roommate if you send me your information and you're not fucking weird as shit. <laughs> I have a feeling that that might be, you know, sus. For a Twitch chat person watching me, it would be my roommate. That would be a bad idea. But um, fucking yeah, dude. I I don't know how to like afford modern day world. Yeah, dude, it's pretty ridiculous. Oh, with saving money. Okay, I can go out there and get obviously get by, but mm-hmm. I'm gonna break even every year if I just go live my life. Also, I spend like an idiot though. I spend thousands on DoorDash. I spend. Yeah, dude, King, that, that's the spend, one thing that's yeah. Dude, I spent ten plus thousand a month last year. Mm. Yeah, I know. I'm bad I have nothing to show for it. Take out, yeah. I have nothing. Yeah, dude, I'm really bad with that shit too. And that's but, when but rent that, wasn't even as high as it is now. If rent is yeah. what it is now, and I go live somewhere in a big city, I will make no money. It's yeah. gonna just be <laughs> nothing. Yeah. If I sit in my parents' house, at least I make some money. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> it's boring, but at least yeah, you're you're banking a bit. Yeah, that's what I did for like a long ass time, and like, and then yeah, I just kind of got some cash too. I just want to go buy fig- land and six- move up. My- yeah. This guy says accept six figure jobs and you'd be fine. I I got plenty of those. No, it's yeah. not the same, dude. Yeah. It's got to be. I need like three hundred k. At least, yeah. I need like 300k minimum, or I can't move. I'm yeah, fucked, dude. That's pretty much, yeah, minimum. That literally is the bare minimum. If you want to like comfortably live on your own or have your own property, that's like ha- That's that's like shit. <laughs> like, like that's not even like a good property. It's like 300k. Yeah. Uh, 
I mean, the amount of money that shit costs right now is fucking absurd. Yeah. Yeah, because I yeah I just got like half a million. Cause bro, like, there's this shit called taxes too. Yeah. Yeah, the taxes. You yeah. Fucking have to spend hella money on taxes. But yeah, same. I'm. I'm to pay twenty k in taxes. Yeah, same. It's it's insane. It's insane. It's bro, I make forty five k. This guy says, bro, I make forty five k and own a six hundred k house. God. Damn. Okay, buddy. Okay. It's possible yeah, okay. if you have a good enough if you have a good enough savings and uh, you sat at your fucking parents. He's been for at the same straight years. He's been at the same job, time, bro. Well, no, if you've been at the same job for like five years and you have like a like at least like a hundred k saved as a down payment, you could easily get a maybe maybe two hundred k. Oh, oh, you'll do. I mean, okay, you probably bought your house at one hundred k and now it's fucking six. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. With inflation, There's yeah, no you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You a lot. Not this year. K. Yeah, not yeah, no way, not this year. Yeah, no shit. The house is fucking like up to ten x in the past. Fuck. Yeah. In, uh, like five, ten years, not even. Yeah. The housing yeah. market's fucking inflated insanely. You make if you make four forty five k right now, you're not buying a six hundred k house. You're fucked. Yeah. There's no fucking chance. I was looking you at a chart. What was it? it? Was like it was like it was ten grand below ten grand to buy a house like in the nineteen sixties, just after World War Two. Is like. It was stupid. Doesn't even make sense. I look at the chart. I'm like, are you serious? Like, yeah. Yeah, it was about it was like five thousand, six thousand dollars to build a, a decent house for a family. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I have a hell of friends that have way like less money than me, but I, I, they just, I don't know. I think they gave up though. They just get hammered like every fucking day. <laughs> that's a, that's society though. That's how everyone's been. Like, your life has to be fucking Project X and fucking, uh, what's the one with Jonah, Jonah Hill? It has to be those two movies every day. You gotta go spend money and fucking go to the bar every day. Go fucking indulge like a retard. 300k total comp. Yeah, total comp's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, not three, 300k bases. No, you don't need that. But 100k, yeah, 100k in a big city, you're basically regular. Like, you're not, say, you're not, like... Unless you're like a saving god, but if you're just a regular person making 100k living in a big city, you're paycheck to paycheck. Gone. Yeah, really. it's gonna be gone in like a month or two. <laughs> maybe, maybe for yeah, maybe two. Like that shit goes right to rent, taxes, food, and fucking other bullshit, transportation, all that shit. At 200k, you know, you could save some money, but you know, 200k is not that easy to get. You usually have to kind of work hard for that, you know. Yeah. And 300k, you have to grind. So, but that's what it's worth. Okay. What the issue is 100k is not 100k, not enough money. 200k, that's enough money. But the people that will hire you for that amount usually want you to work really hard. If I'm going to work really hard, I want 300k, but I don't get the, all, those offers. So, I'm, I'm just going to sit at my parents' house and make YouTube videos. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, I'm a bit of a saving god, so I just sit and just... If you gotta invest, bro. You gotta take the money that you have and just not spend it. Pretend that it's not there and just stick it into a fucking dividend or ETF. Or just, and then just... Can't. Three years later, you come back, you're like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, I had a little... Mo uh, money trees do exist. Oh, shit. <laughs> Money's nah, bro. I can't do that shit. I yeah, literally I spend so quick. Dude, yeah, I... It's tough. I just... I've... I started... I... I if I have too much money, I gamble. Hell yeah! Also, I just bought a twelve thousand dollar watch. Oh yeah, that's retarded. What, what is what is it? Is it Mariner? No. No, I was trying to get that, but uh, the Rolex ADs they take like a year Ooh, or two. Nice to... roll up, roll yeah. No, I got a Juju Lacou or whatever the fuck. Oh shit! Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh well, okay. Well, that's the problem. Well, I want a, I want nice shit. Yeah, it's like work hard. What the fuck? I want to buy. I want to fucking buy um, you know, way more shit, dude. Yeah. I want fucking seven computers. I want like okay, right now I want a 10k PC. That would make my streams better, right? If I got a 10k PC. Hell yeah. And some oh, T1 well, internet. there goes fucking 10k though. True. Tell of money. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like damn, like. A good, that's crazy that a PC could cost ten fucking grand. Yeah, if you get a 
Big got boy. just to have a good stream. I gotta get a fucking. I mean, I probably could get by with a 5K PC, but still, that's pretty fucking decent amount yeah, of change. Probably. But you 5K? Pay. That's hella fucking you money. Imagine internet. if I had an apartment your, and shit to pay for internet, it too. internet. That's what you gotta up, up pay. Like that's the thing. You have to. You're gonna have to pay monthly for a fatty internet bill because you want that high. I got the best internet balance. anyway. Though. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So. Yeah. But that too. That's drive? Expensive right yeah. There. Oh, a car. Oh, let me get a fucking car. Why don't I? Let me get let me get a fucking Tesla with the fucking car insurance, the best PC, fucking Fuck yeah. best watch, best apartment, me, best fuck insurance. Oh, you need insurance for me. all that too. Yeah, I need yeah, a yeah. fucking million. I need a million fucking dollars. Yeah, like straight up, bro. I need yeah. literally a million bucks to just to be able to focus on. Style. Yeah, just to be able to focus. Yeah, I need this to focus on my work. I don't want to focus on anything else. Everything else is taken care of. Boom. Now we can now we can produce valuable content for you. <laughs> But, um, like you should make OnlyFans? I mean, bro, honestly, I probably could get some money on OnlyFans. But that is kind of fucked up. Right? But it's weird, though. I thought it was fucked up, too. But then, I don't know. There's other people, like, they're like, it's not porn now. And I'm like, what? What is it? What is it? What is it? I actually made this thing buy me a coffee, which I could put something on. I, I just found out about this shit. Apparently, I can make a page out of this, and people can, like, buy me coffee and get content or something. That's kind of, like, OnlyFans, but, like, you know, more positive. Yeah, there's, yeah. like, I met this kid in Austin who, he's gay, but he does gay OnlyFans content, and he makes <laughs> six figures a month. Jesus Christ. So, there is a market for gay OnlyFans content. Yeah. For gay dudes to watch fucking dudes. Uh, or whatever the fuck. You know, Yay. it's not me. It's not my style. But yeah. <laughs> if you guys are desperate, that, you know, there's a market out there. I need, um, once you go into OnlyFans, goodbye to a fang job. Bro, already goodbye to a fang job. Fucking Google rejects me. Dude, Google. D motherfuckers get into Google for my. I don't even know how many people got into Google. Like, hey, watch your videos. Fucking neat code, the fucking YouTube channel. That motherfucker stole my entire. He stole my thumbnails and watched my YouTube channel. He gets into Google code? before me. Code. Yeah, shit. <coughs> can't get into that shit, dude. Yeah. Reject me every fucking time. I don't. Amazon wants to hire me, but I don't want to fucking work at Amazon. That place is dog shit. Yeah. Yeah. Want fucking Bezos. <laughs> I only uh, want Google, and Google does not fucking want me. It's <laughs> annoying. Well, I mean, if you, uh, <laughs> I think if you died, your, <laughs> if you moved to uh, India first, got a citizenship there, then applied, I think you get it hired. <laughs> no, nah, that's 100%. not it, dude. Hell of people get into Google. I think I'm just kind of um, white. No, dude, it has nothing <laughs> to fucking do with that. Just kidding. Just kidding. Kevin Naughton works at fucking Google, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know. But yeah, true. About, is it what? What? What is it then? I think that I'm not positive enough, and I am. Uh, well, I have. I'm. I think I have. Uh, I'm not even edgy, but I think I'm too edgy for Google, which is cr fucking annoying. I think so. Yeah, I think you're too realistic. You seem like you sound like what I would most people I think want in entertainment in the industry which is just somebody who kind of doesn't give a fuck but like it's just like you're this is how the majority of people are normally like they're not like hey guys how's it go oh hey how's your day oh you're having a great day well look what i'm doing today i got a great job and my fucking no no that's not how fucking reality works we live in a fucking shithole dirt ball nobody needs to nobody's gonna talk about that but like i mean you're just you know i mean you're you're the, the level Round, Nick, you could still easily get into Amazon. Yeah, no shit. They want to hire me like every fucking month. Yeah. I, they try, dude. I have the managers trying to like hire me. Like hella fucking people get into Amazon and then refer my videos or whatever. But guess what? Amazon is boring and lame, and I don't want to fucking work there, dude. Hell no. That mm -hmm. their logo is literally brown, bro. <laughs> it's literally your brown. logo is brown. Like I don't know. That's a boring ass logo color. I gotta say. Makes me Among think of cardboard things. boxes, which also suck. Cardboard boxes opening that shit. 
Like I, that's one of the least favorite things in life is opening a fucking cardboard box, in my opinion. So I hate cardboard. <laughs> Paper bags. I don't like fucking. I I don't know. I don't like Bezos. I don't like the welcome videos. I don't like any of the way. I don't know. I don't like that company. I like Google, but they don't like me. <laughs> I have a literal love song. I literally made a love song before for Google. And, um, <laughs> they still just not have they it. Don't fuck, they don't fuck with me, dude. It's weird. It's kind of weird. Unfortunate. Sus. But uh, they will hire a bunch of randos that are not even that good at coding. It's all good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sounds about right. Sounds about Google. But, um, yeah, I don't know, man. I'll probably, I don't know what I'm going to do. You'll easily make 300K at Snapchat and Netflix. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't, I, I don't want to work. I heard Netflix is really bad, but, uh, Snapchat, I heard Netflix is like, you have to try so hard. Um, it's like super try, like your people, I think there's like a list of places that you're afraid to lose your job and Netflix is one of the top ones. God damn. But um, Snapchat would be cool, but I don't think Snapchat would hire me. They're they're like they're kind of a smaller, in the grand scheme of things, they're smaller. Seem like a smaller company than you know the biggest ones, and I don't know. They it's I, I don't I don't know if they would hire me. I don't know. Did I just put out a video and just be like, "Yo, someone give me three hundred k. I will work <laughs> anywhere." Yeah, Snapchat is pretty fucking. They seem to have. They seem to not give a literal fuck about anything. <laughs> they just. They got everybody on there. Spotify would be lit. I don't think they would pay that the big bucks like that though. Maybe. Spotify. We got like audiobooks or like what the fuck? Yeah, I get it. Yeah. Go to a company and become CEO. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Facebook. Facebook could be cool. But yeah, maybe if I just posted a video like, "Yo, someone give me 300k." I will work my balls off. I just don't think anyone would have, like, nobody would do that. <laughs> no, I don't think people have enough faith in me to do that. Fucking hire me. You gotta get um, base. Uh, yeah, I think I just gotta grind YouTube at my parents' house. And, uh, I mean, we got 30k of sponsorships. That I could fin- I could literally make 30k in the next 10 to 15 days. The videos are gonna be really fucking bad, dude. Don't, Don't it into a long term <laughs> stop. The the little ego you have- yeah, the issue is as soon as I got that money, I'm buying a Rolex. <laughs> Hell yeah. There's no way. I just want that roly 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 with a dab ranch. I'm way too stupid. <laughs> nah. Pretty sure all of us would. Hell no. Nobody would do that. If you got a shit ton of money coming in on the reg. I don't. I do not. Rolly, yeah. It's still actually, it is an investment though, if you think about it. Because like, it doesn't lose its value technically. Honestly, I think Rolexes are pretty, they, say, they seem, when I research them, like the best ones to invest in could buy them from like a retail store or whatever but also i'm not so sure with some of the fakes like, yeah. that i've seen are so good that maybe in the future there's just going to be too many fakes and uh value won't be as good but still you still have the option to just be like uh i'm thinking we can get my money back for this yeah possibly interesting but that's why a lot of people invest in jewels doesn't really depend I bought some gold the other day too. Fuck yeah, man. That's a good one. Actually, this economy economy's fucked. Right? Bitcoin on Is it? it? Central bank currencies coming out. Is the economy bad right now? Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, bro. But I'm getting like really good sponsorship offers. Yeah. I figured they would go down. Gotta keep a little. Nest egg. Keep a couple, keep a couple of nest eggs on the side. For those like money. That too, but also just like I think I would keep a couple sponsors or whatever, just a couple here and there. 
market's not terrible, but it's not good either. Here's how I feel. When you're going into the winter, things are going to get bad. And when you're going into the summer, things are going to get good. In the summer, I have never felt any economic... I've never felt any pressure. Everything just goes smoothly in the summer, I feel like, for some reason. And uh, in the winter is when bad shit happens. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Yeah, because everybody's going out. I think that's out just because... And motherfuckers are just have energy in the summer yeah having a good time it's fucking vacation time party time it's positive and you could just work more because it's just nice out and you it's just fucking more positive vibes in the winter i don't want to do shit i just want to fucking you know watch movies and shit get that so. sids i got that seasonal depression she she like if you look up uh when the economy's doing the best versus worse, I guarantee winter is the worst season for the economy every year, on average. Oh yeah, yeah. Abs oh, absolutely. Everybody's bundled be. up in, in in their houses, trying to stay warm and shit. Nobody wants to go out and do. You yeah. go to Jamaica? Yeah, okay. Let me do that. No. <laughs> go check out a crab man. Get some fucking lobster. Get some. Get some uh, herbals. Some herbal remedies. What is your? How old are you? I'm 32, dude. No, you're not. Yeah. No, you're not, bro. Why not? Cause you fucking sound like you're fucking 19. Okay, sure. I'm 32. You're not 32, bro. Damn. Okay. All right, I'm, all right, bro. I'm 19 years old. I'm 19. How old are you? I'm 32, bro. Oh shit! You do fucking sound like you're 19. So what is your plan? My plan? To, uh, for the rest of your life. So you told you to invest a bunch of money into stocks that pay out dividends and live off of dividends and uh, become an angel investor for, for people that are going to pay me out three times more than what I'm going to invest in. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. How much money do you need to be set for life? You know, like you said, a million dollars is pretty good. A million dollars, you get a million, you you spend it right. You 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 can you can be, like, just barely okay. I think it's like twenty or thirty k a year you can make off a of milli investing a milli. Okay, so that's probably and not doing good fuck all and like being a saver. I don't know. Guy. A, mi a yeah. million, a million in index funds, I think, is eighty k. Nowadays, it's like you know, it's like half. It's like Simpy. forty. Like it's. The S and P gives you like seven. So I'm telling the market's for shit. If you look at the S and P lately, it's fucked. Well, if you invest now, maybe it'll go up a lot. Mm -hmm. We gotta invest when it's invest when it's low, buy low, sell high. No, but Seems just like, oh. yeah. I just Seems do like long term, low risk. That's that's. that's my yeah, I have um I have a sponsorship right now that's due in a few days. It's for Wealthfront, which is one of those fucking ETF. It's like Acorns. One of those where they just split it into S and P ETF type shit. Oh, bro, that's what and, you, uh, that's hell yeah, bro, that's what you want because it's insured too. It's it's all secured. Like if if the market crashes, your money doesn't disappear. You you still have your money. What do you do? The very Invest in use. You just don't no. touch your money for a couple of years. They do shit with your money, and then you get. If more you money. have all your money in one of those APY cryptos, you're on crack. I would yeah, never do that. Stupid. Yeah, no, it's too risky. I'm low risk all day. Fuck crypto. Fuck eat. Fuck uh, NFTs. <laughs> fuck all. Yeah, I've got shit. no NFTs. I got a little bit of. I have point one Bitcoin, and that's all. Yeah, I Bitcoin. Have. Yeah, okay, you're good. Yeah, I, dude, I was. My buddies were farming back in the day, like when Bitcoin was worth nothing, and the only thing you could use Bitcoin for is to order drugs off of fucking Silk Road back in the day. The people yeah. that um, I was in these spaces a couple months ago, and um would join all these stock and crypto investing things with a bunch of people. Mm. They would tell me that I can make 17,000% APY. We're convinced that you can make just thousands and thousands of dollars overnight. And there were all these little APY fucking, um, what were, I don't know what they're called, where they just hold your money, staking. Yeah, yeah, there, yeah, there was all these staking <laughs> platforms. And then literally, I was getting roasted. It must have been a thousand people. They were roasting the fuck out of me. They were yeah. like, they hated me because I was like, yo, 
I don't know what you're saying, but you are not getting fucking 17,000% on your money. There's no <laughs> yeah, fucking way. no fucking never. They were telling me that I don't understand the technology uh... and that I need to read the fucking white pages and that I need to look it up. The exact platforms that they were talking about and they were all putting their fucking money in, they were scams and they rugged and they're all fucking gone now. Yep, yep. Yeah, all of those people literally it was a thousand people roasting yeah, me and they all lost their money yeah they're fucking st- the, uh, the market and the economy like everything's fucking stupid crypto nfts it's just mind-boggling and like that's why i like some of the quotes where they're like you don't buy nfts to fucking make money you buy nfts to convince other people to buy nfts because <laughs> that's the only way you're gonna make money off of them <laughs> I, I only bought two nfts and i sold them for lower yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. You got to buy something. Yeah. It's, t- t- it's a total scam. You just got to buy something that you know is going to get hyped. And that's why, like, a lot of these celebrities were doing it because it's a total. I don't know. They get it. It's an un fucking. Well, and now they're cracking down on it. But, like, Safe Moon, all that shit's getting cracked down on. But when it first started, it was an easy scam. You fucking buy in, sell high, get the fuck out of the company. It drops. It's still hyped up because it's like, oh, it's the new, it's the new Bitcoin. Nobody understand what the what the fuck's going on. Even with Bitcoin, all these if they're intelligent at all, they'd invest their money in a warehouse and just buy a bunch of fucking graphics cards and start buying their own Bitcoin. You you make more money mining your own, starting your own your own little mining fucking little little miner setup than fucking yeah. investing in any fucking Litecoin or any other bullshit Ethereum. Doge, all that other stupid shit. My buddy's like, yeah, I was considering uh, doing that too. I don't, fu- I don't know, man. It's worth. It. It's easy to run. It's not. It won't cost you that much. And yeah, mine yeah. is the way to go. I mean, I could. If you're you gonna get into pay. crypto, just fucking mine Bitcoin. That's it. Just mine Bitcoin. Yeah. I mean, I um. Well, I have um. This guy, I was gonna buy a mine. You could buy a miner for like ten to twelve k, mm-hmm. and they put it in their warehouse, and then they run it for you. Also, I don't know who the fuck these people are, yeah. and that sounds sus. And yeah. then at the same time, you're, you're gonna, gonna want- mine. Mm-hmm. You should actually buy a miner for Ethereum now because either yeah. that you get RTX graphics cards. Mm-hmm. It's like four or five to mine ETH effectively. But with Bitcoin, you don't get RTX graphics cards. So if ETH fucks, gets destroyed and you lose it, at least you get the graphics cards if you um, go with the ETH miners. But the Bitcoin miners are made with some other you shit. Use like any graphics card. But with like, yeah, whatever. Like you, It's better if you just get somebody that you know and set up your own shit and monitor because then you set up your own wallet. And like you're mining into your own like offline account and then you can start fucking around like... All right, maybe I should respond to this guy. Hold on. I did respond to this guy. But yeah, I said that I didn't want to work with this company. And then he said, do you still want to work with us? And then I said yes. So let's see what he says. But yeah, maybe I'll just do this. So I'm saying just get that extra little bit of whatever. So yeah, it was like 175k, dude. I might as well. I don't fucking know, though. Mm-hmm. I'm also Mike. Just quit that shit. Who fucking knows? Yeah, of course, you gotta vet him and shit. U.S. or Canada taxes here forty percent. So is everyone like? Sh- are people? Sh- I can't tell if people. I feel like I, I don't know. Can't tell if uh, how the economy is going. That's fucked. Is it? Yeah. yeah. For me, it seems fine. Honestly. Yeah, it's if you pay attention to the stock market, so they're kind of doing some weird recession-y stuff. Everyone in the chat, are you guys poor or rich? <laughs> you middle class, poor or rich? Middle class is very nah, rare. middle class. Don't rare is exist, unicorn. Bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Rare middle class, middle class gods. Rich. How are you rich? Where do you work? You work at fucking some bank company? Is it mommy daddy rich or like got lucky rich? Live with your mom and work is sweet. Poor poor shit. <laughs> <laughs> broke broke. That's funny. So wait, what do you guys do? So how are you gonna not be poor anymore? It's nice talking to you. I'm gonna... All right, peace.